So what do you do? You found a real estate deal. You negotiated in good faith. You did a contract, a legal binding agreement where you negotiated the price and terms. And then the seller comes to you after you've opened escrow, deposited funds, got your attorney, maybe even found a buyer for the property if you were doing wholesaling or something like that. And now the seller calls you up and says, no, I want out of the deal. Uh, what they're really saying is they found somebody and they got a better price. That's usually what, what occurs. What can you do legally? Well, you know, uh, my legal opinion is you stand tough. This is called, this is why we have contracts. And you can basically say to them, you're in breach of contract. And if, if there's no really justifiable reason within the contract or something you didn't do wrong, um, then you should stand your ground. I would definitely recommend you go to an, your attorney, get some good legal advice, send a letter to, the pros, to that uh, seller and saying, um, I'm going to take this to court. That will delay the whole matter. Uh, it'll, it'll incur legal fees on both sides, by the way. Uh, but if you have a deal, and I recently had a client, and I just got another phone call, which kind of stimulated the uh, idea for this video, where they stand to make a lot of money on a real estate deal. And they did everything right. They did a very nice contract. Everything was spelled out, signatures, dates, uh, consideration, uh, timeliness, identification of the property, all the good things that should be in a contract was signed by all the uh, owner, uh, all the um, principal pro um, people in the transactions and um, stand your ground. Um, first thing I would do is say, okay, uh, where does it say in the contract you can just cancel it? Uh, unless your state has some kind of uh, uh, grace period or cancellation time period. Uh, but usually uh, the deals I've been hearing about, this is usually weeks or months later, prior, very close or prior to escrow. Make sure you stand your ground, say, look, um, I didn't do anything wrong and you can't just change your mind. That's why we have a contract. And if you um, don't want to negotiate with me or fix this, um, on my next move is to call up my legal advisor. Make sure you stand your ground. Make sure um, you, know, you don't have to give it up. I know this is stressful. This is not the way you want to do business. But in many cases, the seller will, um, they got bad information or they got emotionally involved or they just got greedy and got a better offer. Make sure that you get good legal advice and um, have a letter sent right away to let them know that you're going to fight it in court and possibly do an action for a list pendants and maybe put a cloud or uh, on the title so they can't sell, sell it to somebody else. Um, stand your ground, um, negotiate in good faith, do business honestly, ethically, upfront. And um, when problems do occur, the whole reason you have a contract is to protect yourself because nobody deserves success more than you. And so make sure you're always protecting yourself. I do answer my own phone, 970-281-5151, or go to my webpage, claudediamond.com. Have a good day.